see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car in the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car in the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Ooh, I've been on the flex since flex on. Neighborhood all in your eardrums. I ain't never scared like bone crush. Boy, I got God, don't fear none. My line busy, take no calls. Feels like I don't have no flaws. Snakes in the grass, cut those off. Yo, squad shady, my bros rock. No breaks, we go, 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 go. Throw shade, that's a no, no, no. Go high, go low, low, low. Like spinning in a 644. Cash money like 504. Ball like AD24. No sleep, me, mo, mo, mo. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car in the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car in the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Ooh, I'm a real one, my day ones. Try speak up, can't say none. Try dig dirt, there ain't none. I make the money that save up. 10 to 80, my savings. Take the top on the base one. New car, race on. Fast lane, pace on. With the boo, y'all, that's a flex. Now I'm human, I am from another planet. I'ma teleport, my vanish. I'ma wake up, do damage. Drawing number seven, he's bored though. Working all night, need more though. I remember nights I was poor though. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car in the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car in the giddy up. Secure the bag. How are you guys, lads? How is everybody today? How are all of you guys? Unfortunately, we can't go to a normal intro for like for copyright reasons, but um, I'm streaming this on YouTube because, well, I don't know. This channel is kind of like, I kind of want to get this channel going a little bit. I know live streaming will help on that. How are you, Antonio? How are you? Um, but yeah, we're going from start to finish on this. So, lads, this is going to be the speed run. This is going to be a speed run. This is going to be on the DBG Live YouTube channel, all of this. And this is probably going to be on the DBG YouTube channel as well. So, we are going to speed run this. Three, two, one, go. Okay. Single player. Um, we're starting to triple track. Come on. We're going as quickly as possible for this, lads. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I, I just canceled the time by mistake. There we go. I thought that you could minimize the tab while still being fine. There we go. Time is it for me. It is like nearly midnight. It is nearly midnight. Okay, let's go. We get 86. Oh, I'm an idiot. Wrong thing, wrong thing, wrong thing, wrong, wrong thing, wrong thing, wrong thing. Great start. I started off I started off by wasting 50 seconds at a speed run by using the wrong team. That is how that is how to start a speed run. If um This is a perfect reset time. I've missed uh I've missed cannonless lads. I've missed cannonless. So it's uh, it's reset time. The only reason that I'm competing in this is that I'm able to do this is gonna be because of Carlos Boozer. He's got David Thompson, congrats. Don't let Denver f hear about this and he'll beat me. I don't care. If someone beats me to a speeder on time, they can get it. Trying to get the steals. Oh, I forgot they hit out 100% in the earlies. Okay. We're good. Okay. What are you doing? What are you doing, Hornacek? Where are you going, Hornacek? Literally, the only reason that I'm good is because I got silver, um, I got silver, what's it called? Um, Beyblade, post spin technician. The Bronson's unfairly treated basketball player. I don't disagree. Uh, give me that. I missed. I'll take that. I'll take that. I've also lost a little bit of my speed run to upload a video. 
You guys can always, by the way, you guys can always, always look at the DBG video a little bit later. At the playlist, no money spent, 2K22. There we go. So we got no money spent. We got a no money spent video out just there. So I do apologize. But you can always watch that later. Okay, trade laws, we're there. Chase down. Boozer, come on, be better. Why is Trey Lyles guarding my point? Get out of there. There we go. Just literally get him with the dream shake and a post spin. Most Ray for Alston. Most overrated player in history, I don't know. If we're talking about overrated for their what they did in their career, it all depends on what you're looking at, like. Like, there's a lot of guys that are rated really highly because they had a good career and their peak wasn't great. And then a lot of guys that are the opposite, where, like, they actually didn't have the greatest careers ever. But they're still seen as super, super uh, players. Like, it likes his... You can argue it. You can argue a team act, like. He's like, he never won a playoff series. Play some NBHD, Nick. I'll play some NBHD, Nick, earlier. Need a diamond LeBron meta. Okay. Marquez Johnson is okay. Oh, I'm an idiot. I wasn't even watching. I just let Kevin Love score. My well, ARL boss will compare. I said, I'm like a, a bad Draymond. Imagine if Draymond was bad at basketball. There we go. Don't bat. Had I got all my tokens, I've played so much of this game. Like, it's silly how much of this game I've played. Good switch. Oh, the AI is just unfair. Someone's told, someone said top three, team act me top three in today's NBA. I mean, Tracy McGrady was like the one of the greatest regular season players there has ever been. Top three this season, that's just ridiculous. That's just ridiculous. Current Kevin Durant is better than any player from the 2000s. Any version of any player from the 2000s. Except for maybe, maybe mid-2000s Kobe. There he's got switches. T Mac, I mean, we saw T Mac choke in the playoffs plenty of times. Before he got hurt, how did you miss that layup, Boozer? T Mac choked plenty of times in the playoffs before he got hurt. And then, ironically enough, when T Mac started getting hurt, his team started winning. His team nearly made the NBA Finals the year he didn't play. He, the year he, didn't play, he got hurt and didn't play in the playoffs. After getting first round the year before. It was underrated Tony Parker. People saying he's not a top 10 point guard of all time. And Tony Parker almost had five rings and two finals MVPs. Like he was a Ray Allen shot away from being 5-0 and in the finals with two finals MVPs. And was the best player on a team with Tim Duncan. For the best part of a decade. I don't even need, I don't necessarily need to win this game because I'm going to have to play some more TTO than this. Oh my god, would you just pass the ball? I mean, can Trey Laws shoot it? I'm literally not pressing any buttons. Oh my god, grab it. Okay, dream shake him. There we go. Mate, the freak! How is every time someone's near him, it's a contested layup? He's the most... I've never seen someone get as many contested layups in this game as Boozer. Actually, I don't even need to score Boozer. I can just score on anybody. I was... Why am I trying to score a Boozer? Why am I not on Twitch? Because... Some... I don't want to stream twice in a day on Twitch.
Oh, I'm an idiot. Run him off. Give me that game. There we go. T Mac is better than Tony Parker. He didn't have. He didn't have Manu. Did you just say the Finals MVP Tony Parker, who almost car like I will say it, almost carried San Antonio in 2013. Tony Parker carried the Spurs. Like Tony Parker carried them in 2013. Every clutch shot in that series was hit by Tony Parker. Danny Green hit some threes. Ma yeah, Manu on the bench. Man, Manu in those last two finals runs was not Manu. I was all said and done, the Olympics might give Manu the better, like, better legacy, but Tony Parker was way better than Manu Ginobili. Tony Parker was arguably the best point guard in the NBA for years. He was easily number two after Chris Paul for years. Best team to never win a championship. Um, I mean... Uh... I don't know. Oh my god. There we go. 90s Jazz. Uh, maybe? No. Um, 60s Lakers. They lost eight times in a row in the finals. 60s Lakers. 73 win Warriors. Yeah, 73 win Warriors are the best team not to win the championship. But they won three. You're saying Tony didn't look good because he had Tim Duncan. Tony Parker was the best player on that team for almost, for probably seven years. From about 2008 to uh, 2013, or 2014, honestly, Kawhi really picked up in 2015. Heck, even in 2014-15, you could argue Parker. Like, Parker for seven or eight years was the best player on a team that included Tim Duncan. And Tim Duncan's considered a top four, a top... 10 player of all time. And for a third of Tim Duncan's career, Tony Parker was the best player on his team. So I don't understand how Tony Parker not top 100 debate is like a, is a thing. The AI mellow, you do realize, did you, you actually just said Chauncey AI mellow? Like you do realize that they traded AI to get Chauncey. And they were straight awful with Iverson. I mean, they lost first round of the playoffs every year. They need. It was only when they got Billups that they made the one Western Conference final. Parker's obviously a Hall of Famer. Parker's the first battle Hall of Famer. Like, man, who's a Hall of Famer. Louis Skoll is a Hall of Famer. It's the Basketball Hall of Fame. It's not difficult. Tony Parker, top 10 point guard. Yes. No question. No way of so what's about it. He's top 10 of all time. Like, as of right now, Rose... Rose is better all-time than Parker. That is one of the most idiotic statements I've ever read. De what, the, what is Derrick Rose? I'm pretty sure even in points per game for their career, Tony Parker is, is ahead of Derrick Rose. I'm confident of that. Wow, Derrick Rose won a rookie. Derrick Rose won an MVP. Tony Parker has four rings and a finals MVP. And was the best player. Like, he didn't win finals MVP, but he was the best player on the 2014 Spurs. He was the best player on that team. Like... Again, a Ray Allen shot off two finals MVPs and uh, five five and zero in the finals. You're taking CP3. Oh yeah, that's I'm not arguing Tony Parker over Chris Paul. Finals MVP is not greater than MVP, but when you've won four championships and have a finals MVP, and I'm pretty sure Parker has more All Star appearances than Derrick Rose as well. I'm, I could be wrong with that, but I'm pretty confident he does. Russ over Tony. I mean, you could. that's a legitimate argument. I have Tony over Russ, but you can argue that. 
Like, the Rose over Tony Parker argument is, is ridiculous. Hey, bring it out of my way. Where are you going, Hornacek? Here we go. I'll tell you, the pace is because I an all-star guard with decent wing. They can become contenders with Sabonis. Um, I mean, I don't necessarily rate Sabonis that highly. I mean, Russ over, Russell Westbrook, four, what's it, four seasons where he's averaged triple-double? It's, like it's either three of the last four, four of the last five seasons. Like, no, if you want to argue Tony Parker, Russ over Tony Parker, you're fine. If D-Rose didn't get hurt, um, Tony Par he would have ha passed Tony Parker all time. That's, again, that's ifs. You can't use ifs, like. Okay, there we go. We got Emeralds. And we're, we're, we're going for this. We're going for the strat. We're going for the new strat. Uh, you guys don't understand. This is some, like... This is the, like, the new route. We're going for the new speed running strat right here. We are going to be right now. Um, Surge is A tier easily. We are going to, like... This is the strat that people don't know about. This is, like, the new strat that's going to help me break the uh, no run boom percent world record. Um, playing current gen for the dunks. It helps me get the uh, thing as much as, as as quickly as possible. Emerald two guards. I didn't open a pack. Dirk is better than Malone and KG. Um, again, like you can, I think you can argue any of the three is the best. I, I actually think that's a that's a legitimate argument you can make for any of them. So, um, like I'm not gonna just blanket statement say that Dirk's better than them. Like you can argue. Am I doing a speed run? I'm just this is my this is my no run boom percent speed run like. I cre I'm creating this category. So um what the hell is There we go. My stupid Xbox this track catches everything. No agenda tracker. Um give and go. What? I'm not gonna get the dunk here. Oh, we got it, we got it, we got it. Let's go, that's one. What's it like being a math, a math teacher? I'm not a, currently a math teacher. I have not been a teacher since the March the 12th, 2020 was the last day I've ever taught a maths class. And it was the it was a disastrous class as well. I was trying to teach, um, I was trying to teach central symmetry to a bunch of 13 year olds and I failed miserably. I failed miserably at it. It actually was the worst, the worst class I'd ever done. Was the last my last day, which I dunked that. Do you think Tony Parker was better than Nash Kidd Darren in the two thousands? Better than Darren in the two thousands, without doubt. And also, Tony Parker's peak was like early twenty tens. Why? What? Can. Sometimes the sometimes I miss the burst and this is these are the times when I miss the burst. It made these challenges easy. The burst made these challenges easy. No. 
Like again, Simmons is there, so I'm, I'm genuinely not going to uh, get basket side. You see, Simmons just shoves me out of there. Check, man. Any kids a fan of my channel? I think so. I, I see students that I taught every now and again comment on my TikToks and it's just awkward. But I'm in general an awkward person, so like, nothing really changed that much there. Biggest finals asterisk in history, I mean, there's no, I don't believe in finals asterisks. Thoughts on PSG barely winning against Marseille. I mean, they just signed Messi, they're not going to be winning every game, like, as I say in thoughts on Manchester United barely winning against West Ham without Mikel Antonio. Like, they needed Mark Noble to miss one of the most ridiculous penalties I've ever seen. I've never seen, like, subbed on to take a penalty. Did we not learn from, did you, England, like, did he not learn from the Euros? You do not sub on someone to take a penalty. Like, even was it the Italy-Spain game, almost everyone missed that was subbed on to take a penalty. Thoughts on AC Milan? I mean, they're a lot better than they were five years ago. Like that. There we go. TG integration, like, what? I mean, not on stream. I don't, I'm not confident that I can teach integration while trying to speed around Daryl Griffith. I'm not very confident that I can. Does LeBron three people with those Bulls teams? I don't know. Does MJ take, to, uh, MJ does not take 2007 Cavs to the finals. I don't think, I'm not sure. Like, I'm just saying that right now, like, MJ, LeBron was better because LeBron made players better. And like, that's the whole thing where it's like MJ at the start of his career would have put up 40, but they were going to lose. MJ with though in 2007 would have been like Kobe in 2006, putting up like 40 points a game, but um, not made, and he wouldn't have made the finals. Like you can't forget, like a big re obviously he put them on their back, but like a big reason why they made the finals was the likes of Damon Jones and Booby Gibson looked like legitimate, like, really good players on that team because of, Le because of LeBron. Like, that's... I don't want... I don't like the 2007 argument because that wasn't what MJ was. Jordan couldn't beat Chris Webber on his last legs. Michael Jordan didn't win a playoff series before he got Scottie Pippen. And Michael Jordan in his rookie year was the same age as LeBron James was in 2007. So... Like, who would LeBron make better? He got the 2007 Cavs to the finals. You don't, you don't bring a team to the finals by yourself. That is literally impossible. It has never been done, and it will never be done. There are offenses that are structured around one player. Pippen was built by Jordan. Do you not remember Scotty? Like nearly making the NBA Finals in 2000s with the Blazers. Like, they choked. Do you not remember him nearly making the NBA Finals without Jordan? Jordan couldn't beat the 86 Celtics. Of course, like, he didn't lose just once in the playoffs. Is there a replay on Twitch? No, I'm live. Oh, why did I go past the screen away? Jordan carried Scotty in the Jazz series. Yeah, LeBron carried freaking Dwayne Wade for half of those series that he played. Like, LeBron carried Dwayne Wade in 2013 and 2012 as well. Like, that's a dumb argument to make. Dwayne Wade was better than Scotty. And LeBron technically carried him. 
after Jordan built him. That is disrespect to Scottie Pippen. That is disrespect saying Jordan built Scottie Pippen. Did Jordan make help improve Scottie Pippen? Of course. That is disrespect to one of the greatest basketball players of all time saying Jordan built him. Yeah, I'm just going to ignore this Emmanuel guy. He genuinely is just making ridiculous points. He also sold D-Wade in 2010. Yeah, because LeBron James played in the 2010 NBA Finals. Jordan won with Scrubs before they got Robin and Kukoc. You're talking about BJ Armstrong and uh, Bill Cartwright who was like a 20 point per game score before he went to play with Jordan. Or uh, Horace Grant. You're calling Horace Grant a scrub? Okay, um, I, I just want to hear this argument. I just want to hear this argument. Like, hey, if you actually just called BJ Armstrong and Horace Grant scrubs, then if you want to make that argument, okay. Okay, if you want to make that argument, it's fine. I think it's a ridiculously dumb argument to call Horace Grant a scrub. LeBron caused D-Way to finals. I mean, they don't make the finals without LeBron James. They don't go 2-1 up without LeBron James. I even want to make that argument. Dwayne Way he got Dwayne Wade two rings then, 2013 and 2015. And 20, sorry, 2012 and 2013. What happened the year before? What what happened the year before LeBron went to Miami with Dwayne Wade? Did they win the first round? Did they win the first round? LeBron playing Jordan's ear, he wouldn't be able to flop. Oh yeah, because a six foot nine, two eighty pounds freight train is would struggle because he couldn't flop. What? LeBron played in the early 2000s. You do know that, don't you? Like, LeBron legit... Everyone's like, oh, LeBron couldn't survive in their era. LeBron literally played in the early 2000s. People don't seem to remember that. Like, LeBron was dominant in the early 2000s. LeBron nearly won... M LeBron was second in MVP voting in a season where Detroit still had Ben Wallace. Still had Ben Wallace, Rasheed Wallace. They still had the gang, 2006. He was, he was second MVP voting. People talk about, oh, how would LeBron survive in their era? He literally played in the most physically dominant, physical era of the M in NBA history, which is the 2000s. That is the most physical, slow-paced era of NBA history, is the 2000s. And he played in it. He played in it. Like, it got so bad that they had to bring in... They had to stop hand-checking. Because n the game... No one wanted to watch basketball anymore. Like, people don't realize the hand-check rule was brought in. Because no one... Because people stopped watching basketball. No one liked watching... Games that ended 75-69. LeBron won did not win MVP in 2008. He won MVP in 2009. Kobe won MVP in 2008. If Jordan's play, say, one more year and saw old Jordan versus young LeBron, that would have been crazy. How many 90s players can survive in modern NBA? I mean, the greats, I think, could. But, like, I think the great, the star players definitely could. The difference is, is that role players have to do different things. Is that you could literally barely be able to dribble a basketball, and if you were seven foot tall had a good good base, could set screens and get rebounds, you would make the NBA in the 90s. Whereas nowadays, you actually have to have some skill to be a role player. But at the same time, you don't need to be strong. To, you don't need to have that as much strength to be a role player as you used to. You don't need to put your body through the, through everything. Like, what those, some of those guys put their body through in the 90s is crazy. Like, I think the... Like, it's not... It's just different things. The star players would still be great. Ray Allen, the clutcher shooter of all time. Um, I mean, I mean I'm mean, i pretty confident Dame is. 
Like, I'm, I'm a Miami Heat fan. Ray Allen hit the biggest shot I've ever seen. I woke up my entire house screaming when Ray Allen hit that shot. I'm still saying Dame's the shooter of all time. And you know, you know who I'm putting in the argument for clutch shooter of all time? Kevin Durant. Kevin Durant. Like he nearly hit the big one of the biggest shot. He nearly hit the biggest shot in playoffs history. Like he would have hit the only ever game seven game winner from being behind in NBA history. Well, I. The Ray Allen shot's probably closer because they were down three. They lose if they're... They, Ray Allen's probably closer shot ever. That's wrong. But, like, he literally... Kevin Durant was a half a shoe size away from hitting probably the second most clutch shot in NBA history. Robert Ory. I mean, big Shot Bob did hit some big shots. Fade Universe on the line. I want Iguodala. Has Iguodala ever hit a game winner? Kawhi game seven. No, Kawhi's game seven, they were tied. They were tied, so it was going to overtime. He did hit the only ever walk-off game winner in a game seven. Um, but they were tied. Kevin Durant, they were down two. Like, they were down two. Forget Steve Kerr. I mean, Steve Kerr is not on the Ray Allen level. I mean, ISO Joe is up there. ISO Joe is up there. If you uh, know anything about Joe Johnson back in the day, ISO Joe has to be up there. ISO Joe is... He's one of the most underrated players of all time. He's actually one of the most underrated of all time. Five tokens, I'll take it. I have like, Five tokens is the same chance of Ron Boone. I've got five tokens seven times right now. It's annoying. Make nine dunks with him. Ten steals, Daryl Griffith. Okay. YouTube stream, yeah. I'm gonna be doing these a lot more often. My late night streams are gonna be YouTube streams. I don't like streaming late night on Twitch. I really don't like streaming late night on Twitch. Primary Allen didn't miss. I mean, he literally missed 60% of his three, roughly 60% of his three point shots, so. Spam. Bang. Why am I on current channel? I need dunks. I need dunks. When was the last time Leeds made the Champions League? 2001, as far as I'm aware. Made the semi-finals. Made semi-final with a team of kids. We're like the youngest team in the league. One of the youngest teams in the world. And we blew it. We blew it all. Ridsdale. Ridsdale. We ended up in League One. But now we're back. I'm probably going to get relegated. Like if we're if we're in the relegation zone by Halloween, we are screwed. Like, we are screwed. Leeds literally have to send out their under 18s team pretty much on uh, against Fulham in the cup. Oh yeah, like the Rockets were were beating that Bulls team. The Rockets just the Rockets had their number, and I think again Jordan even said it like they couldn't deal with Hakeem because of just the matchups. There's no like. It's not saying the Rockets were not better than the Bulls. The Bulls are better than the Rockets. But the Rockets would beat the Bulls nine times out of ten. Because they had one of the probably two best Michael Jordan defenders in the world. I'm not going to call him a Jordan stopper. But a guy that could contain him as much as possible in Vernon Maxwell. Um, they had shooting in Kenny Smith. Oh, take the dunk. 
There's no NBA equivalent of Leeds. Like, if a team gets in so much financial trouble, they almost don't exist and get literally relegated. Oh, I don't have any steals. Spurs look terrible against Chelsea. If Jordan never retired, they would they would not. He would if Jordan didn't retire, he's six and two in the finals. I still think they win the second tree, Pete. Or seven and one. But he does not Jordan lost like without Dennis Rodman, they don't win the second three piece. Like they got demolished by the magic. They couldn't deal with Shaq, and then Rodman came. Salah more famous or Curry? Um, Mo Salah is more famous than Steph Curry. It's not, it's close, but Mo Salah is more famous than Steph Curry. Like, Mo Salah is a god in a lot of the worlds. Yeah, if Jordan doesn't retire, he wins at least one more MVP. I, do, I don't disagree with that. But I don't think he goes, I, he loses in the finals. He doesn't win. He does not win a straight in the finals. Why am I acting like why am I saying this fact? Well, the Rockets were like 8-2 and two against that Bulls team when Michael Jordan was there. And they also... It's not like Jordan... What did Jordan do in 1995? They lost. He lost before the finals in 1995. Like, that Magic team got demolished by the Rockets. If he beats that Orlando Magic team, and then he suddenly loses to the Rockets in 1995... Coming back halfway through the year. I mean, Kevin Durant didn't play for a year and a bit. He didn't play for a year and the season... Kevin Durant didn't play for a season and a half of basketball. No one will give him that excuse. Am I wrong? Season started at Christmas. Kevin Durant didn't play basketball for a year and a half. Same amount of time. And no one gave him a, no one gave him a pass. Because he was injured. Like, it's the exact same, the exact same amount of time off. So. So why is that any different? Except the difference is, is that one, one player was injured and couldn't stay in shape, while the other player was playing another professional sport and did stay in shape. Lol, Viduka, the first player I ever had, had in the back of a, a football jersey. My favorite player as a kid. I loved Mark Viduka. I also loved uh, I also loved Alan Smith, but uh, he then went and joined Man United. I don't hate him like most people, but no, he's not a he's not a legend. Emerald Dow Griffith is useless. He's useless. He's absolutely useless. Give me that. I didn't get my dunks. Leeds versus Newcastle was a really good game. I mean, we had a... Can you imagine Jordan? Can, can somebody just mute this guy? Can someone actually just mute this guy? Can someone just mute this guy? I'm not... I don't want to talk about Michael Jordan. I really don't want to talk about Michael Jordan. I really don't want to talk about Michael Jordan. That's just a... Just... Anyone who believes in the devolution of basketball... Anyone who believes players have devolved in over the last 40 years, anyone who believes players are better have devolved in the last 40 years is crazy. My opinion. Randa will not win a BB. Judy's Randa will not win a BB. How many dunks do I need? It's like, it's probably like two or something. 
One. We missed by one dunk. Oh my god. Um. Okay. Giannis better Malone, yes. I mean, more than likely. I think Wembanyama will do. I mean, Wembanyama, as of right now, is better than Holmgren. But it's hard to tell how someone that that gigantic is going to make a freaking dunk. How someone that gigantic is going to do in the NBA. Oh, give me that. To me the board. It's Ryan Hollins. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm gonna be streaming a lot quite a I'm gonna be streaming quite late on this channel, honestly. Oh my god. Can I both spin him? No. Please dunk it, please dunk it. Thank you. Lee Boyer is a legend. I mean, I mean, he was pretty good. He was pretty good. Was it FIFA 3 where he had the potential to be the best player in the world? Cannot see Holmgren. Did Ryan Holland just shoot a three pointer on me? I mean, Holmgren is pretty good. Again, if you're going to use too skinny, then like that's almost every player nowadays. Are you going to say, are you also going to say Amani Bates is going to be good in NBA? Is Robbie Keane a legend? Of course he is. I'm Irish. Robbie Keane is a legend. There is... Like, he is probably... Like, there are not many guys that are worse than Robbie Keane that have had have the legacy of Robbie Keane. That's all I'm going to say. Make a damn shot, Duncan. You missed two wide opens here. Steal. Oh my god, no. Green. Good. Shay Given is a legend. Yay. Of course he is. It's Shay Given. Of course it is. Shay Given, man. This is who I am. This is this is who I am now. Like Shay Given was is a uh, one of the I'm not gonna say he's one of the best keepers, he's definitely one of the bad he's definitely a top like twenty goalkeeper in the Premier League era. To be fair, Durant was too skinny, he's the best score ever. Yeah, exactly. Leeds have a lot of Irish fans, yeah, Leeds have a lot of Irish fans. Playing, playing full of Leeds fans pretty much every uh, every time you go over to watch Leeds game. I don't know why I ran floppy there, but still, quick stop green. Oh, <gasps> Mick. Denny Avdi or Josh Giddy? Um... I mean, Giddy's ceiling's higher. I think I think Avdia is going to at least be a solid player. He just got injured in his rookie year. Avdia is going to be a really good NBA player. Do I like John Giles? Yeah, why wouldn't I like John Giles? I actually met him in Leeds. Like two, three years ago? When Leeds played Stoke. When Leeds played Stoke, first game of the 18-19 season. I uh, I met Johnny Jaws and like all the uh, the leads, like um, past leads players in a hotel in my hotel. If you're ever in Leeds and you go to Bewley's hotel after games, like you always run into leads players. It's it's mad. If you go to Bewley's hotel, you either run into a, an old old leads players or uh, the leads players themselves in the bar. Maybe it's not as much nowadays, but like that used to be the whole thing. You'd uh. After a Leeds game, you would uh, you go down to the bar. You'd, you'd be in Booze Hotel, you go down to the bar. And I'd be just sitting down with my dad and every single time. Like, obviously, I'd, I'd be too young. I was too young at this stage. 
But like there's people just having having a couple of drinks with all the leads team. Like it was a it was such a weird club like that. Like like you'd see the players walking about like like it was nothing. They were just part of the city. Like they were like McGregor now. But that's why. That's why, like, there's, it's different being a Leeds fan than being a fan of anyone else. And it's hard to even, it's hard to, it's hard to explain it. It's really hard to explain it. What position the Leeds need a new player? Everywhere. Everywhere. Except goalkeeper and Calvin Phillips' position. They need a backup for Phillips. Everywhere except for where Ilan Melier, Melier plays. Actually, no, we don't need a striker. We don't need a striker. Bamford's good. And, uh... Bamford's good, and then Thing is a... Thing is pretty good. Player basketball player? I mean, it's a hard one, like... I like Luka Doncic. Lee's man is very good. I mean, he's he's... His biggest, his biggest achievement of his career will be not getting his lead. If he doesn't get this release team relegated, it's the biggest achievement of his career. Do I still sponsor DC Basketball? I mean, definitely not. I have not, I have not sponsored since I was in DCU. Even though I will be, am I technically a lecturer? In DCU from next, from next week? Is Drake bigger than the Beals? Oh, that might be the dumbest thing Amish has ever said. That might be the dumbest thing Ambish has ever said. That Drake is bigger than the Beatles. I love Ambish. That is probably the dumbest thing that has ever come out of his mouth. That Drake is better than was. That Drake is bigger than the Beatles. Colin, any scrimmages this week? Um, I don't think so, honestly. Um, we just had a we just had a basically a, a running session in a in Aidens. So I don't even. I don't even think we're gonna be. There's gonna be much scrimmaging. I don't know what state I'm gonna be in tomorrow. I'm in bits right now. I'm. I think I'm playing. I'm probably playing D6 this year as well. Favorite football team not Leeds. I mean, why, why would I have a favorite football team? Oh screw it! I'll just go every every neutral's favorite team in the Premier League. Leicester. Every neutral's favorite team is Leicester. Okay, we are actually so slow on this non -ron, no run boom percent. Imagine liking Ambish. Ambish is a good, really good guy. He said a lot of he says a lot of just crazy things, but he's a good guy. Okay, now we tank our record. Now we tank our record, lads. Um. Okay. Power forwards, Boozer. Oh, we actually have to use Carlos Boozer, which is scary. We actually have to use Boozer and a freaking Donovan Mitchell. Favorite boxer MMA fighter, Katie Taylor. My record is gone. My record is just gone. It's 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 over. My record, like I, it was it was fun, lads, while it lasted. Me having a good record in my team unlimited was very fun while it lasted. Or not my team unlimited in TTO. It was fun while it lasted, lads. Uh this guy's squad's not good either. Okay, this guy's squad's terrible. I can actually win this game. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Make that. Good boozer. Let's go. Beckford and Becchio. Man, that was a I that was an um the League One combo. Man, those League One leads teams. Like you don't why are you running away from your man? Like if you weren't if you weren't there, you don't get it. Those League One leads teams. Or even the championship leads team, the team that went up. Like if you weren't if you weren't the part of that, like like nothing will ever compare to um the day we got promoted. Like, yeah, I get it. We were way better um, in the Premier League. We finished ninth in the Premier League. None of that compares to the day we got promoted. Every single person I know that's a Leeds fan, we were all just texting each other. 
We were all taxi each other. It was the... It was... I'm not going to be crazy and say it was one of the best days of my life. But it was the best day of all of 2020. 2020 was a rough year with lockdown. That Leeds team made, made lockdown so much better. Like, that Leeds team made lockdown so much better. Name a Leeds player to play for sporting. Easy, Rafinha. If you want to ask a Leeds player to play for Benfica, it's Helder Costa. Make that good. You missed that, really? One more. Green that. Come on. Good job. The clay challenge doesn't stop you owing 9 threes. No, you can score to 41 points in the clay challenge. That's the easiest way to do it. That's the quickest way to do it. Because the game ends when you hit 41. I mean, Rookie Dom takes like a couple of minutes later. I mean, Rookie Dom might actually just be the easiest way to do it. Because you can score all the shooting guy three-pointers. Rookie Dom. Give me that. Oh, he's so chicken. He's so chicken. Yeah, the challenge stops after you hit the nine three-pointer. But you just don't hit nine threes. You just score a bunch of twos and then hit nine threes. If that challenge on rookie, I'd do it. Well, 250-0 DBG make a return. I don't know. I got the 62 and 0 this year. My first loss was in the draft as well. I'm getting popped sometimes in the draft. Like my teams, I've drafted a few really bad teams in a row and I'm getting popped. There we go, good shot. I just need as many points with Dario Griffin as possible. And this, this is a game where I really need points with him. Like if I can get 13, 14 with him here, that's huge. Space, 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 space. Give me that. Chick man. Oh, he's so chicken. He's so chicken, lads. Can we just appreciate just how chicken he is? There we go. Oh, I thought we had him. Why am I not streaming on Twitch? I think we're going to do the night streams on YouTube. And you never know. You never know. YouTube might become the main one. If you well, if YouTube want to pay me, YouTube will become the main streaming. I will gladly leave Twitch if YouTube want to pay me for a YouTube deal. Give me that. Bad miss. Bad miss. Bad miss. It's fine. No, don't let him hit that. Prime Ronaldo. Prime is down. Prime Ronaldo. I think Prime Ronaldo is only trumped by Prime Messi. Steal. No! <laughs> Lads! Did we just do that? Lads, instead of getting a steal. Instead of getting a steal, he just scored an own basket. Instead of getting a steal, he just got an own basket. And oh my god, glue hands. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, glue hands just triggered. Can you just can you explain that? Glue hands just triggered. Glue hands just triggered, lads. Can someone use the YouTube clip feature to send me that clip? To clip that and send it to me? Glue hands just triggered as he missed a steal to score an own basket. That is not that's not real. That is not real. Oh my god, I am absolutely, I am devast, I'm in shock. That's middle board, isn't it? Come on, come on, come on, give me three or four tokens. I'm, I'm easy, with, I'm good with either of them. Barry Douglas shaking, and Barry Douglas was good for us for a while. Great, great backup left back. I mean, he's definitely better than this Furpo kid we have right now. Jesus, he looks he looks beyond useless. He looks this Furpo guy looks beyond useless. 
Prime Keen or Prime Asian? Prime Keen. Prime Keen was the argue like arguably a Ballon d'Or contender. Your mom wrote to them for their anniversary and they sent a card signed by Bielsa congratulating their 30th and chucked all the players' signatures for free. Unreal. Man, Leeds is some. Le I love Leeds as a club. I love Leeds as a club. Is Dow Griffith worth the grind? I don't know. I don't quite know. Um, I will get him anyway. There's a reason team like, yeah, I mean, they had Jordi Alba. Like, there is, there is like, it's understandable why Barca let him leave. That doesn't mean he's bad. Just because they have Jordi, like, just because you have Jordi Alba doesn't mean that team is bad. This is a, this is a GG already. This is a GG already. This is a, um, boozer. Oh, no, I got pick and pop glitched. Got him. I literally got pick and pop glitched. This happens all the time now. Where your, your game freezes when you try to call a pick and pop. Quality over quantity. I've never... That is that is a phrase that has never come out of the mouth of Mick Curley. Look at that. My game's... Like, it's frozen. It's completely frozen. And you can't... Uh, it's literally a pick and pop glitch. It's so annoying. It is so annoying. Harrison Martins is horrific. He's terrible. Can you see where the screen's coming from, honestly? Where that? Good defense. It's his board, probably. Steal. I don't know where he's going. Shoot that. Good shot. Invisible custom jerseys. Are they still a thing? Good. Oh my god, Boozer. Actually, let the L2 button work. Wrong button. Oh, ch chick man, I guess? Big boy, big boy. No. Steal. Steal? Oh my god, Daryl Griffith. You are so ass. You are so bad at stealing the ball. Like, he's so bad at stealing the ball. And I can't run pick and pops because I'm freaking glitched. I'm in the pick and pop glitch. Three. Green, come on. That's chick. Big board. Catch the damn ball. Good. Give me that. Come on. We need this white. Oh, my God. That was wide open. You gave him a white. We missed a wide open white. I mean, why did we... The one time I actually want to switch, my players didn't switch. When I'm trying to switch back, my players didn't switch. Should I just quit the game? Come on, he left him. He left him. At least get points with him. Oh my god, man. I was about to say, oh, will you just let me get points? But I'm like, no, that doesn't. It, that's not how this works. That's not how this game mode works anymore. You can't do that anymore. Green. I, I kind of want the ball drop. I kind of want the ball drop and I want my points with Daryl Griffith. Like, I'm, why do I keep getting caught in a freaking pick and fade glitch? There we go. Good shot. Is Ruby Vucevic any good? Nope. Oh, we had it. He can just go into the post here if he wants. And he, he overcomplicated that one. I gave me a wide open shot in the corner with Donovan Mitchell for three. And I smoked it. Big boy, big boy, big boy. Oh my god, that ball hit the ring three times. That ball hit the ring two more times than it needed to. Thank God he, he deserved a full bar there. Give me that. I deserve this white. There we go. Oh, we're back in this game. We're actually back in this game. Derek Jones Jr. is incredible. Derek Jones Jr. is incredible. 
Ever thought of doing a micro series? I've thought about it. I'm not doing it. Pick and pop glitched. Oh, what are you doing, Dow Griffith? Oh, good foul, man. Good foul. Anyone here from Australia? I reckon because of the time of the day, it's probably quite a lot. Give me that chick. Oh, we took the lead. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, wait. I don't know what happened with my matchups there, but... Postdocs are calling my name. I mean, postdocs aren't that OP. I'm literally... Why do I keep getting pick and pop glitched? That's idiotic by me. I've got this. I can get this in this position here. Steal. Can you steal the ball? Like, Daryl Griffith is physically incapable of getting playing a lane. He is physically incapable of it. Me not. Decent look. Bad miss. Bad shot. There we go. Oh, it's wide open. Thank you, Dagger. Let's go. We could win this game. And that would be massive if we win this game. Because this guy has, has an actual squad. This is not a scrub, like pinch he's passing it out he's not too, shooting that he hit that really okay it's fine she said diamond three point boost um i don't know i don't really know about diamond boosts dot him green that come on chick big white i needed that man oh we got blessed um dot him i need this chick come on let's go Good defense. Terrible shot. Big board. Daryl Griffith with a huge board there. He's got 15 points here. Give me that. Oh, we spiked. We got a... We literally spiked. Now, we, it was a contest anyway, so it didn't matter. Terrible shot. He's he's in panic mode. Give me that. Big white. Oh, 2K. Stop screwing me. Stop screwing me here. I just missed a wide open catch and shoot white. Steal. How? 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 Can you explain? Can you explain? Dar he is physically incapable of getting a steal. Daryl Griffith. What is Daryl Griffith doing? Shoot the midi. Good, let's go. Now we are in control. Like, real control here. No, that's a steal. Steal. Shot clock. Okay, good defense. Okay, we didn't get pick and pop glitch that time. Good. Dot him. Green. We missed. But we hit the white. Let's go. How did we win that game? How did we just win that game? How did we win that game? We just played a sweat. Like an absolute sweat right there. And we're also working towards our like... Working towards our 75 points. And we're not that... Like we're at least... We're close to halfway to that. Is Mismatch Expert... Yeah, Mismatch Expert is the best badge in the game. You just shoot... You literally just shoot the ball. Antonucci was chicken. I mean, Antonucci could legitimately score. He was a score. He was not a great scorer of goals, but he was a scorer of great goals. I watched Antonucci one year against, I think it was Burnley, scoring on the first game, first home game of the season, scoring an absolute worldie. On oh, Jack, now we go. If we go five and zero, I'm just saying. If we somehow manage to go five and zero. 
with this lineup right here. I really am just the best. I really am the best if I can go 5-0 with this lineup. <laughs> How many challenges off? Um, when I beat this, not that many. The 92 three point as a two guards is probably what's holding me off. But this is no wrong boom percent, which is unbelievably difficult. If you guys don't know, this is not too bad a challenge, but the no wrong boom percent makes it very, very, very difficult. What the hell is a player? What's a player indicator? Anyone know what a player indicator is? I should win this game. I should win this game. This guy's a bot. Give me that. Check. Let's go. You just blew me wrong. On check. Now we go way up. I'm really good at early game because, like, the way the game is played is so different. Like, in early game, it's all about, like, abusing mismatches. Not every player can shoot. It's about, like, getting open, shooting good shots, playing patient. They're all the things I'm really good at in 2K. They're not the things that are rewarded in late game. Patience is the worst. Like, if you're patient in this game, it's really rewarded. If you're patient in late game, it doesn't matter. Not only does it not matter, like, it's actively better to not be patient and just rush. You're better off rushing rather than trying to be patient. Bad shot. Oh, wow. Is this one where I could get a bunch of steals with him? I mean, this is a this is a beginner. This guy obviously got Larry in his pre-order pack. Like, this is a bot. Like, good hand. Dunk that. There we go. Basically, everyone is good in late game. I mean, I suck in late game. I'll be the first to admit it. I suck in late game. I absolutely suck in late game. Like, there is no there is no player in the world that has a bigger drop-off. But it's every year. Like, obviously, week one DBG in 2K21 was different Was different level. Like, I was I was the best. And I'm, well, I'll am i say it because I figured out stick shooting. Like, that was nothing to do with skill. That was just I figured out... a broken mechanic that nobody else and I did it better than everybody else I'm terrible in late game I've never been good in late game in 2k everything that I do well is what is like suited towards early game everything that I do badly is is what like my reaction time is not good my reaction time is not good at all Shoot the ball. Come on, throw the pass, throw the pass, throw the pass, throw the pass, throw the pass. Steal. Oh my god. He has literally the... If there was a... Hey, that's the worst. He has the worst hands I've ever seen. Oh, we missed it. Oh no, I thought he scored. Can we 21 out? Are we 21 out on this guy? I mean, Griffith is uh, balling out right here. Griffith is balling out right here. I'll take the foul. Kelly Oubre is chicken, yeah. He's, he's cash. He's really good. Okay. Come on. No, no, no. No, no. I'm 20 when owing this guy. Because I actually kind of want to get the top board. Because, oh, that's, a, that's unlucky. It's me, it's me being bad. Good defense. Big board. Give me that. Man, he's like two in a row. I literally just want him to throw the passes on. Spam. Take the foul. Let's go. Has TTO going? We're three and zero. This is our. We're gonna be three and zero when we win this game. Oh, it's me! 
Oh my god, how do we knock the steel there? I think I've only got like one or two steels on him though. Give me that. Too deep. I literally just want three pointers. This guy is still sweating me a seven. Fair play to him. Fair play to him actually still trying a 70 nil down. Is it annoying? Yes, of course it is. But I can't knock someone for trying. For actually attempting to stay in this game. I need a 75 points. Come on, give the ball to Zion. Give the ball to Zion. Give the ball to Zion. Come on. I know you want to. Oh my god. Just green. Two. Why am I live on YouTube? Because, I don't know, because I want to. Okay. Oh, I should have been there. No. Okay. Three ball, three ball. Do not, do not guard me, chick. Let's go. Come on. 22 out. Wow. Why is Ron Boone such a big deal now? Because basically you need Ron, Ron Boone is the best jazz player in the game. Players are at war or we're changing or keeping it the same. I mean, if this game breaks, I'm... We'll be very, very annoyed. If this game changes too much, I'll be very annoyed. Because there is no way that you, they can... There is 0% chance that they make the game better. 2K have never made a game better with a patch, by the way. 2K have never done it before. 2K have... There is no... Can you... Is there any example of 2K ever making the game better with a, with a patch? Ever? With a big game-changing patch. Is there ever an example of 2K making the game better? Ooh, Ducks, the Ducks League. Oh, 350. I I'm number one up on that court, I'll make you great. The first one in, the last one, I can't call me lazy. Put in my hours, send the invoice, send the payment. I need six rings like MJ. What's that? I've won three, is it? Zen patch, yes, sorry, Zen patch. But Zen patch didn't change how the game worked. Like, Zen's was patching a thing. People are, cha people are saying patch defense, which fundamentally changes the game. There has been fundamental game changes. The speed. The speed of, um... Yo, Toddy, how are you? Like, the speed patch was a fundamentally game-changing patch. Okay, this team's... This team's awful. Please tell me this guy... This guy's probably a bot. I mean, not. Pushing. That didn't fundamentally change the game. Like, te like they're like small patches. What people are asking for is for defense to be nerfed, which is fundamentally changing the game. That's like... Changing the way defense works is like changing the, um, the speed of the game. It's just like, it's an actual game changer. Things like getting rid of pushing and if they took out the speed burst. Yeah, there are good things that can be patched. But a full, a full gameplay patch has never been good. Your TTO tactic got some hateful messages. I mean, that's a that TTO tactic got me a win against. I beat. I'm just Isaac on delay using that tactic. Like I'm legitimately beating comp guys using that tactic because they're they're out here using Kyrie. They're out here trying to actually do something with Kyrie. But no, 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 no. That's not how you do it. That's not how you do it. You spin. Green. We missed. Wow. Jump. Ah, Mick, you're better than that. Paint defense needs needs to be buffed. What? What do you mean by paint defense? Paint defense is is literally just chase downs right now. Like I'm beating this guy. I just really want some threes. Why is my name better than HDB? He's just. Because um, it was going to be a joke that... Um, because I was under the impression before the game came out that everything was cool between me and 2K and that I was going to get a logo. So I wanted to make it a joke that 2K verified I was better than HDB. 
But um, I have since been informed that no, things are not cool. And I will not only not be getting a logo, that um, I am public enemy number one. And uh, I can... It, it was originally that I couldn't work with 2K Global, which is fine. But I was still okay to work with 2K UK because they were a different branch. And now they've banned me from that for no reason. They actually... Well, obviously, I know the reason. But like, they didn't actually give... The reason they gave me was not a real reason. That's all I'm going to say. The reason... I know why. Like, simply put, the rants about packs are gambling is why. Like, you can, you can talk as much crap about this game as you want, and it's all good. It's the rants about the packs. Simply put, it's the rants about the packs. And I understand it. But, um, that's the, that's the better than HTB name story. That it was originally meant to be a joke, because I thought I was under depression that I was probably gonna get a logo. And now that I'm not getting a logo, it's kinda just, I just don't wanna pay for another one. I don't like, I don't like spending money I don't have to, I don't wanna spend 15 euro on a name. Like, I played a year, I played almost an entire year as One Way Mick. I'm cool with playing as better than HDB for a year. It's no worse than One Way Mick. Jump. It's fine. Have a check better than Jordan because he's 8 now in the finals. No. I don't like the 6-0 and o argument for, for Jordan. I don't like the quote undefeated in the finals. If Michael Jordan only played six seasons, then fair enough. But like he played, what was he, played 14 seasons and only made the finals six times? Like, he made the finals less than 50% of the years he played. So I don't like the 6-0 and o argument. Because that's, that argument that from people that say it's better to lose in the first round than lose in the finals, which is dumb. I have cost... I think I have made 2k more money than I've cost them. Personally. I think I've made 2k a lot of money. I think I've made them a lot of money. Like, in the seven figures. I think... But I think Car guys like Carlos's net is 10 million. I reckon Carlos has made 2k 10 million. I reckon mine is like low seven figures. Like, I reckon maybe I've made 2k pushing 1 million. But I think Carlos has made 2k at least 10 million dollars. I think Kilzamoy is probably about 7, 8, 9 million. Henry's probably up there with Kilzamoy. Um, But I still think I've made them a lot of money. I made, I've made 2k a lot of money. But there are other guys that have made 2k more money. I'd say of people that have made 2k the most money, I would say Carlos is number one, followed by Henry, Henry or kills him ways too. I've made 2k the most. Do I go corn? Did I get corn twice in a row? No. I mean, I'm not... Oh, Tro yeah, sorry, Troidan, Troidan. I don't cons- Troidan's transcended my team, so I just don't consider him in the- in that conversation. Because he's just transcended my team. That's four, isn't it? We have won four out of, we have literally won four out of five games. Matt. We've won four out of four games. And we could have go. And how many points have we scored? Have we scored 75 multiplayer with him? I have two steals with him. I have 71. So I have four more points and one more win. I'm just going to do it in the next game. How did I get this far up the board? Like trolling, basically. Using these guys. I'm if, if I make board 10, I'm the best. I am the best. I'm just the best if I make board 10 with these guys. 
Flight alone gave 2k. Flight spent 30k last year. And his team was barely better than mine. And I spent zero on VC. Too high money for 2k is huge. Oh, this is a Jazz guy. Is that Boone? It's freaking Boone. He, has, he isn't completing the wrong Boone percentage. He's just trying to complete this challenge real. He's not doing it. He's not doing it the way we all need to do it. The no Ron Boom percent. I'm hard off balling. I don't think you you know what you're doing well enough to beat me. That's a tough shot. That's a really bad shot, and I went in. Stop. One more. Green. Chick. Give me, at least give me, I shot the same shot as he did. Give me the same outcome. Give me that. Oh my god, get the boards. Can my players just grab a board? Hi, real. how are you, man? How are you? I I need to look up your channel. I've got absolutely no, I have absolutely no idea who you are, but I'm guessing something through highlights. Am I, am I on the right track there? I just spun to nowhere. Who is Highlight Reel? Let me take a look. Let me take a, take a look at the old YouTube. Highlight Reel. Verified person, yeah. Wow! Ah, yes, highlight reel. Sick 550k subs. Trumping. Trumping not only DBG Live, trumping the actual DBG. Not only trumping DBG Live, you are trumping DBG. You are trumping DBG, DBG Live, and B Ball Daily combined. Not another love song. Not another love song. Give me that. Check. Someone who plays five hours a day can be good. I mean, if you're playing five hours of video game a day and you're not good, then you should probably reconsider spending five hours a day playing it. Good shot. He, that's terrible. Oh my God. That was shocking. Donka, please, please, please. Please, airboard. Oh, 2K21. 2K21 cheesed them. <laughs> Just sub, keep grinding, appreciate it. Just, just a heads up. If you're, if you're thinking that this is a small channel, <laughs> um, this I'm literally, I just streaming on this for a once off. <laughs> um, appreciate the support though. Nope. I can't. Am I chick? Uh, I can dunk that. Let's go. Begging for views wants me to let... When have I ever begged for views? I will never hit a million subscribers. Like, it's it's an almost impossibility. Like, I I will hit 400 million views before I hit a million. He just hit a freaking contested fadeaway with Donovan Mitchell on me. If, if the game I lose is to some dude run the Jazz lineup, I will be very annoyed. But he is not completing the no Ron Boone percent speed run, though. He is He's not doing it right. You're not meant to use Ron Boone. That makes two. That like that's cheating. Best player to never win an MVP. I don't know Wayne Wade. That's the best I can think of. I top my head Dwayne Wade, but oh, he left him chick. Spy or load up, load up, load up of hell. Oh my god. Stand. We're there. Good defense. Nope, he made it. Who's asking for subs? Everything, everything feels a bit, a bit 
This guy is playing too, like... He's playing way too honest. What? Why am I not streaming on the main channel? I will never stream on the DBG channel. I don't know what I don't know what streaming does or does not do to the YouTube algorithm. You better believe I will never stream on that channel. <laughs> it's a it's never happening. It is never happening. I don't want to risk it. I don't know if it's going to be a positive. It's going to be a negative. I don't care. I'm making I'm making a living off. I can try out. I can experiment on any other channel. I can experiment on Twitch. I can experiment anywhere. DBG. If DB if I do something to ruin DBG. I'm screwed because it is my that is my it's not my sole source of income but it is 80% of it give me that come on he's got a green come on do I use my CSP I mean I was heavy into YouTube in 2008 2009 2010 so yes of course I watched DSP DSP was the guy back then DSP was the guy if you wanted to watch a game, it was DSP. Like if you were if you're around my age and you remember being 13, 14 and wanting to watch a video game gameplay, it was Dark Side Phil. 80% of the time, why are you cutting, you idiot? Oh no. I need to actually get it. Oh he's got me, he's got me, he's got me, he's got me. Oh <gasps> we got blessed. We got blessed the animation. Would I ever take sponsors if it's the right sponsor? Like I get sponsor offers every day, but like if I if I don't want to, I I hate selling stuff to people. If it's something decent, I'm okay. Like I still kind of you can unlist my streams. Yeah, I just don't. I just don't want to risk it. I don't know if it does anything negative. But I'm cool with the DBG channel not, not having any streams. You're a bit older than me. Oh, why are you celebrating, man? Do not lose. This is a game I cannot lose. I also can't concede more than, more than 19. With a terrible shot. Oh my god, Boozer. Boozer! Literally, I controlled him and he wouldn't. I lost control of the player. Oh my god, get out of there! Donovan Mitchell. Donovan, green. Check, let's go. How much do I think Troy makes off a sponsor? Mil off the gambling sponsor? Millions. That is one thing I will never do. Each, like, everyone gets to make their own decisions. It's, it's every, everyone's morality line is different when it comes to the gambling streams. That is something I will never do. That is something I will never do. And, like, that is something that, if, say, if, say, it turns out that, like, down the line, I do have any sort of relationship with 2K, if they want me to advertise packs or uh, do a sponsored pack opening, I will never do it. I will never do that. That is, if you're, especially, people don't really understand, if they're not from Ireland and England, how big a problem gambling is. Everybody, everybody knows someone whose life has been ruined by gambling here. Everyone knows somebody whose life has been completely ruined by gambling. Oh my god, we just got hit with the bump of hell. Shoot it, man. If you can green, you can green. Oh my god, we just lost that game. Cap. If if I if I was if I wasn't capping, I would have taken the 10 grand I was offered for a gambling stream before. Like, that's three months of teaching that I got offered. That's three months worth of teaching salary I got offered for one gambling stream. Two hour gambling stream. And I wouldn't do it. Even if they offer me one million. Now you see, that's where that's where it becomes tough. But I would, I'd still say probably no. I'd still say probably no. I mean, like, saying keeping it real, but it's like, 
Everything on the DBG channel is an exaggerated version of myself. Even on these streams. Like, yeah, gambling's so bad here. But, um... Lovely stuff. Um, but basically, everything... I don't really care about the game as much as... As much as everyone thinks I care about the game. Like, I really don't. That is just one thing that's I will say. I don't actually care about this game that much. Like, it's my job. I would rather enjoy my job. But the only thing that I'm actually passionate about is the gambling. The only thing that I'm actually, like, dead set against is gambling. Like, gambling ruins lives as much, as bad, like... Being a gambling addict is as bad as someone being addicted to heroin. Like, advertising gambling is almost like advertising, like... Again, it's almost like advertising drugs, like... It is one of the most destructive things. It is the most destructive addiction to have. Outside of... Outside of anorexia, it is the most destructive addiction. You do it for a meal. I mean, that's where... That's where I've never been offered that, so I don't know what I'd do. But I don't think I would. Alcoholics tend to be gamblers. Gambling's more dangerous than alcohol. Obviously, a lot of time it goes hand in hand, but gambling is... Do you think it's smart to buy VC? I mean, yes. Like, because 2K have made it take so long, how did he hit that? 2K may take so long to build for my player. Yes, it is a smart idea to buy VC. As much as I hate to admit it, if you want to play my player and have fun playing my player, it's going to cost you an extra $60, $70 on top of your uh, your purchase of the game. That is the truth. You know, more than a few people live in the same recovery as heroin addicts. Exactly, it's an addiction. It's an addiction. And it's, and it's as dangerous, if not more dangerous, than than any of those things. Am I from Mayo? No, I have family. I'm taking the mill. Now, that's that's some, an amount of money I haven't said that I wouldn't take because I don't know. I think I think I would take it and regret it the rest of my life. That would, I, That's what I think would happen. If I got offered a million, I think I would take it and regret it every day for the rest of my life. I don't think I will ever regret not taking not taking gambling money but i think if i did take gambling money i regret it that's my that's my thought my two cents on it all is that while i don't think i would while i may take it i think i would seriously regret taking it morality versus being a millionaire like i could if this keeps going well for another Half decade, I'd be a millionaire anyway. I don't have to ruin lives doing this. Uh, actually, you can debate getting people hooked on this game mode is ruining lives. You can debate that. You can take. You can debate that. Further down the line, YouTube doesn't end up working as a licensed job. Could you could use a million pounds? I'm also a fully qualified teacher. I have a backup plan. I have enough money saved up right now that I will be comfortable the rest of my life as long as I work full time. I can't retire. Like I'll have to retire like at the same time as a normal person. And I can't retire early, but I don't want to retire early. You can save more lives than a million. No, you can't. No, you can't. Make the damn shot, Daryl Griffith. Make the damn layup. Oh my god, he's got... He gets some ridiculous muttered laps. Swipe, 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 swipe. 
Is the money for the house included? No, but like it's it's in a house. Like that, I'm gonna have a house the rest of my life. I'm gonna have that asset the rest of my life. Why did I do? Why did I switch that matchup? Dunk it. Oh my god, thank you. Give me the win. Please come and teach in Tyrone. No. No. Have I bought a house yet? Um. Well, the paperwork hasn't gone through, but yes. I paid deposits like. Honestly, the NBA is going in Ireland. I don't think so. I think it boomed in like 2013. It boomed with Steph Curry, and I don't think it's grown since then. I think it boomed with Steph Curry. Okay, um, Dara Griffith. 41 points in a single game, 10 steals. Those steals are killer. Um... Oh, she's got a rookie dom job. Um. Dude, Um, single player domination. We're doing okay right now, actually. People aren't care about the NFL. Kind of. Kind of. Who are the worst team? Who are this year's Knicks? Who's terrible? Are any NBA teams terrible? Rockets, maybe? Human, if I retire, I'll have nothing. I mean, I'll just teach. Like, I've... I have a degree for a reason. I have a degree for a reason. Is this world of your music? No, but I've paid for the rights to it. You pay, like, 100 quid a year for these songs. You can hit them, can't you? You can't hit those anymore? Steal. He literally cannot steal the ball. He is the... what? What's his steal rating? He is the... I've never seen a player in my life have the ball go through his hands as much as this guy here. It's 80. That is the biggest lie in this game. The guy that sings songs in my videos knows me to ever thank me. I do not know MBHD Nick. I do not know MBHD Nick. Me that. Check. Tim Hardaway Jr. is brilliant. He is brilliant. Give me that dive, 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 dive. Oh my god, why is it every time you hit the ball it goes out of bounds? Our bare knuckle gypsy fight sort of thing in Ireland. I mean... I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't very much know. It's not like they happen on the street. It's not like they're common. America or Irish kids? What? Can he hit that? That was nearly a nice deal. 
He, I, it's annoying you can't just shoot in people's face anymore. Oh my god, it's on rookie. Jay Sean Tate, man. Oh my, no, he's not on two fouls. Okay, I can't actually press any buttons anymore. Power forward tomorrow. I finished the online 75 points, yeah. Um, is this a, is this for a three pointer? Okay. Are they really doubling that? Are they really doubling that crabs? Okay, thank God I hit that on rookie. Which country is in Europe the best like women? Um, I don't know. Probably like Sweden or something. We ranked, we ranked number one. Um, we ranked like as the number one ugliest males in the world. Irish men, Irish males. Bad times, bad times. Down bad. Every set we've gotten as a PG in a center. Oh, you're right. You are right. Every set we've gotten as a PG in a center as their two two diamonds. You like Grand more than Richie? I, or more than... Um, what's it? What's the dude's name? Griffith? Oh my god. Can you just set him a proper screen? I literally just need a tiniest bit of space. I can't hit a 32. Like This is an NBA 2K20. You can't just shoot in people's face. Green. Irish lads down bad. I know. I know, especially when... Especially when you're considered below average in the worst looking countries in the world. You're like, oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Um, green that. Check, let's go. Dan Corey is green from there. It actually probably works. You're probably right with that. So tempted to press square again. Who's the best token market? Emerald Mason or is that there's four really good ones? Um Mason's really good. Roberson's really good as a for offline. Um Collison's great and John Barry's great. Oh my god. Oh my god, can I just play? They're sending double teams. Yeah. What happened with Goldberg? I don't know who Craig is. I know who Mark Goldberg is. Screw it, I'm pressing square. Okay. Daryl Griffith. Pump fake. Green that. Okay, swatted. Can I hit? Good shot. There we go. 27-7. Now, unfortunately, I don't have that Instagram clout. I only have like 7,000 Instagram followers. Twitter, Twitter cloud doesn't do too well.
Why do I only use my normal voice? Because no one can actually understand my normal voice. Legitimately, nobody can understand when I speak my normal voice. You'd say TikTok, they're all like 12, yeah. I had an OnlyFan girl, OnlyFans girl message me on TikTok before. That was weird. And also make a TikTok about one of my tweets. And start messaging me about Hito Leaner. It was one of the strangest experiences of my life. It was... It may be the strange experience of my life, actually, in fact. It may be the strange experience of my life. It's so crazy that you... you it's unbelievable. Like... It, so, it sounds so crazy that I 100% made it up. But I didn't. That's how crazy it is that I wouldn't even make it up. I couldn't even make up that situation. It was so crazy. Good. <gasps> I ref you said I passed up the fact you mentioned Hito. No, I I think it has to be. I think there's a there's something else I play there. There's something else I play there. Holy crap! I think there's something fishy going on. There was something fishy going on. He was Turkish. No. That was the fishy thing. She was Turkish, maybe. He wasn't Turkish. Off, way off. You said leaners are past and she dipped. Fair, fair. It is fishy. Why was she calm in the heat of it? No, she she made a Twitter video or a TikTok about one of my tweets, and then I responded with something like, um, "That guy is on to something." It was a tweet about basketball, and she just replied with like, "Heat out leaner." And then messaged me was like, oh, I loved watching your videos in 2K19. I'm like, no, this is this is not real. This is not real. This is not real. There's something there's something else at play. And uh, I ignored it. No, I refuse to believe. It's fake. It has to be fake. It has to be fake. There's no way that that's a real like. And that's not some weird, like, catfish or scam situation. There is no way. There is no way that, uh, there's no, there's no ulterior motive to that. No, it's not a little kid trolling. It was an Instagram, it was legitimately an Instagram account with 60,000 followers, like. Like, it was legitimately an Instagram account with 60,000 followers. Or is it not an Instagram, a TikTok account? Belonging to an OnlyFans girl with 60,000 followers. Like, it's not. There's something fishy, but it's not. It's definitely not a kid. He was just a fan. I, I don't. There are, have you have you read my analytics? It is 99.6% male. 99.6% male. Of course it's fishy. Of course it's fishy. Jam it. Flagrant. 
That 1%. You mean 0.4%. David N is probably... He's, pr he's probably on the most right track. He's probably on the right track. He's definitely on the right track. I'm not going to tell you the TikTok. If that is true, then uh, I don't have any, I don't have a cent to my name right now. I don't have a cent to my name right now. So uh, that's definitely not a, like I am penny pinching for the next two years. I legitimately do not have a cent in my name right now. Point four with trolling in the main account. I'm pretty sure it is like legitimately in the I think it is in the double digits, the amount of females that watch the DBG channel. I think it's in the double digits. But I mean, I'm talking low double digits. I'm talking maybe 15. Draymond to 5, it's fine for now, but if you come up against Matumbo, you are screwed. Can he just shoot the heavy? Maybe. Jump. Um, Henry beat I. Yeah, Henry beat I is gonna limit it. And Isaac was going. Isaac in two days has lost to DBG and HCB. In the last two days, Isaac has lost to me on his host and Henry. Dive. Isaac going mads about Henry drop stepping him. Quote that takes skill. Is like. Dude, Isaac, just because you can't, you refuse to use, like, that's your fault for using a pick and popper. That's not his fault for abusing the popper. It's your fault for using a popper. If you wanted to use Kareem, knock a drop step by Shaq, use Kareem. How many of the last three games score more points to your team? Isaac going through it, yeah, this is not a, he's not had a good start. He's not had a good start to the year. Losing to DBG and HDB in two days. HCB beat RCA, yeah. Henry's decent at the game. Like, Henry beat RCA, though, at the start of the year, when RCA had no players and Henry had everybody. So, like that. The RCA one was a bit different, because Hen RCA legitimately was running goals. And Henry, uh, I'm pretty sure he was still had some goals and emeralds, and Henry had freaking Granger. Like, that, the RCA one's different. But now everyone should have a moderately good team. A good, a moderately good to good team. Everyone should have at least that now. I've... This is how long I've been teaching. The first group of kids that I ever taught are now in college. When they were they were 13 when I started teaching them. And they are now in college. That is the long that is legitimately how long I've been teaching. Is the craziest thing ever. Uh, honestly just honestly just got up points. Pinch. You drive at me, drive at me. The wall just greened out on me. Thoughts on Ben Simmons to Houston. Do Houston, Houston have the assets to get Simmons? Do they not just have to give up their whole Harden haul? It's 
Steal, steal, steal. Oh no. Oh, come on. You legitimately cannot bait the CPU. Oh my god, I'm on rookie. I'm on rookie and John Wall splashing on me. Who's 26? Good. Oh, lock take. Let's go. Let's go, lock take. Now we get steals. Steal. Dribble the ball. Dribble the ball. Wall. Come on. Come on. Pluck him. Oh no. It's literally just pluck. It's just plucks. How many steals do I have? Only three with Griffith. Oh my god. I need at least six or seven here. Eric Gordon, come out to the floor. Okay. Steal. Good. Get on Augustine. Steal. Get the pluck. Dribble, 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 pluck. Can't believe Jokic is lower than LeBron or Curry. I mean, it's fair. He's not LeBron or Curry. Jokic is spectacular. He's just not LeBron or Curry. We're about to get a re. We're about to hit a great time on this speed run. We are about to hit a great time on this speed run, especially considering it was no um. What's his name? Percent? No Ron Boom percent. If it wasn't no Ron Boom percent, then maybe it wouldn't be the greatest time. Pluck, oh my god. Steal. Oh, he's on four. Does he only have three steals? Four steals. What's oh, my prediction for Friday? Content, new promo. His promos expire then. I think two weeks, every promo every two weeks. Tomorrow, we might get prime time again. They are literally just boxing me right now. Shot. Come on, it's the, a pluck here on DJ Augustine would be nice. Or on Eric Gordon. That works as well. <sighs> You've got lock take, man. You've got literally got lock take. Mark Eaton comedy on Instagram before he passed away. He's your favorite player of all time. That's crazy. You get robbed to 300, not that I know of. I'll find out. I'll find out. Am I getting diamond out after this game? Nope. Like, I've been doing this for two hours. Like, I still need a lot of the three-pointers with two guards. Fell out. Duncan, get in. So I'm just going to be chucking with Duncan the rest of this game. I looked for plucks. Didn't work. So there's as many threes as I possibly can get with Duncan Robinson. I think this is on rookie, so. So he can shoot from anywhere. He can hit, hit there. Wow. Full court, maybe? No. Who's better, Allen Iverson or Harden? It is the better of Allen Iverson or Harden in game is... Probably Iverson. Harden's not very good. Harden's really not very good. I don't know what I'm saying. It probably is Iverson. Walk him out. Oh my god, they're literally boxing me. Why are they so... Why are they boxing Dunga Robinson like that? That they allow us. Yeah, they allow us is really good. You can't go wrong. Talking about in-game, Harden or Iverson overall? 
Harden's the fourth best shooting guard of all time. I think when it's all said and done, he'll be above Wade. Because I think Harden wins a ring. Wade's one of my favorite players ever, but I think when it's all said and done, Harden's going to be seen as better than Wade. But yeah, Harden over Iverson all time. Yeah. I mean, if you count Jerry West at two guard, Jerry West was pretty good. 13 man or 10 man. 10 man, but run some good players at the end of your bench. Like, run like Darvin Ham and, um, I'm trying to think. Darvin Ham, if you have Derek Smith, Dennis Smith Jr., he's God tier gold. Good. He's got Jojo White, one of my thoughts on Jojo White. Um, Jojo's really good. Jojo's really good. Oh my god, they're sending freaking doubles. Pass out of that. Oh my god. What would Harden have to do to surpass Kobe? I mean, it's done. Harden won't. Harden will not do enough in the rest of his career to surpass Kobe. There is no chance of that. Unless Harden wins every ring and every MVP for the rest of his career, that's the only chance Harden has of doing that. Like the gap between Jordan and Kobe is significantly smaller than the gap between Kobe and Wade slash Harden slash West slash Iverson, whoever you have at number three. That gap is so big between them and Kobe. And even, like, the gap between jo Kobe and Jordan is big, but, like, it's way, way bigger uh, between MJ or Braun. Braun, but uh, you could, I don't care if you think it's MJ. As long as your argument isn't stupid, I don't care. Like, there are people that think MJ's better with dumb, that have dumb arguments, and then I'm like, okay, yeah, I'll, I'll get annoyed at that. And it's same, like, people think, some people have dumb arguments where LeBron's better. But, like... There's legit arguments for both of them. Check. Let's go. Is that Kyrie or Boone? Depends. Are you able to score every time with Kyrie? And are you okay with Kyrie being one of the worst defenders in the game? Taking Harden over Kobe. Kobe was as good an offensive player as Harden. And what do you make? 10 all defensive teams? I mean, Larry Bird's has to be up there with Kobe's. And honestly, Jimmy Butler's is obviously not quite Kobe, but like, man, it's good. His, his work rate's insane. I'm going to well com completely smash three hours on this. I'm gonna completely smash three hours here. I'm gonna completely smash it. Oh, chick, man. Where does Curry rank all time? I don't know, somewhere like 15 ish. You can argue I'm top 10. You can also argue I'm not top 20. I reckon 15 ish is probably the right spot for him. Stop driving at the clock. I don't know what to do anymore. Good. I only scored 94 points here. That's terrible on rookie. That's shockingly bad on rookie. Like you're normally you're last year I was scoring like I was scoring 150 points in rookie games. I used to score 100 points in three minute quarter rookie games, like, with, and like not only in, as a team with, play, with individual players, you score 100. Like it is scary how easily it is score, easy to score on rookie. To be fair, I wasn't focusing like, and I fouled a bunch as well. Top five all time, top of my head: um, LeBron, Jordan, Kareem, Wilt. I don't know, Duncan.
I have Duncan over Kobe, but I know most people have Kobe over Duncan, but it's closing. Give me that. Shoot it. There we go. Bill better than Wilt. E I'm pretty sure Bill Russell himself said Wilt was better than him. I'm almost certain Bill Russell himself said Wilt was better than him. Like, Wilt's, Wilt one time scored... Wilt one time dominated Bill Russell so badly that Wilt got 55 rebounds on him. The live channel's growing a lot recently. It really has it. My videos are getting 200 views on this channel. But, you know what? It's making me about 10, 10 quid a day, which is all that matters. I need 30, what do I need? 75 points with him. I need 32 three-pointers. Okay, I can actually do this really easily. I knew it was another one, one more game rookie dump. Who has the worst three-pointer? I knew one more game rookie dump, four games triple trap. I can get this, I can get this done in like two and a half hours. 33 pointers is nine, yeah, that's, what do I need in three pointers left? Um, Dow Griffith highlights. Um, 65 points with him. And I need four more steals and I need 24 three pointers. No, I'm, I'm going TG offline. Yeah, TG offline. What is quid? Euro. Euro, dollar, currency. Steal. Oh, 2k. That should have been a steal. You screwed me there. Give me that. Oh, no. Yeah. Check. Let's go. Spam. I just need four steals, like... Wilt's points per game in the finals. You're you're looking at Wilt when he was playing with the freaking, like Wilt. Our, Wilt barely scored with the Lakers, so a bunch of his finals came with the Lakers at the very end of his career. That's like judge, judging Wilt by how he played in the Lakers, like judging Michael Jordan with the Wizards. That's not it. Hakeem Gray and Shaq. I agree. That's that is my opinion as well. I'm trying to literally bait him into a corner pass. Shoot that, hit that. Come on, hit that. Oh, we have him, we have him, we have him. Can we just get one of these steals? Shaq is better than Kobe. I mean, that's very, very debatable and a controversial statement to have. I mean, I think just longevity, yeah, probably take Kobe over Shaq. But I mean, Co Shaq was so good. How I just got Lake Lich. How do I get Lake Lich offline? I've never seen anything like that happen before. I've never been Lake Lich offline before. I think Duncan over Shaq, yeah. I, I'd also probably have Hakeem over Shaq. Win three. It's win five TT online against Jazz players. Not even three. I won five out of six. And the only one I lost was against a dude running three Jazz players. I beat every other team that wasn't running Jazz players. I beat someone running a legitimate God Squad. High pinch. How is that not a steal? Oh my God. Give me that. You cannot hit whites on this difficulty. I think it's an all-star. You can't, literally can't hit whites. How, yeah, how can you play Kalen and Jaden? Neither of them... Kalen... 
or Kate? Jalen or Kate? Oh my god, he was just green. I think I'm just gonna probably end this on a game rookie, Dom. Just to get my steals. Because if I can get them, I can get them. It's a two. And it's a... How am I getting leg glitch on every shot? I'm literally playing offline. How am I getting leg glitched? I have full stamina. So it's not a stamina issue. How am I getting leg glitched on every shot? This is really weird. He just and won the green. Like, I literally greened the first, like, four shots I shot, and then got late glitched, like, five times in a row. There we go. That's just a bad release. Steal, 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 steal. No! Oh, my God. KD in the top 15, of course. He should be in everyone's top 15. Please. Oh my god, Mick. Good. Gallo. Green chick. I mean, Katie's probably top 10 of all time. Mick, be better than this. That's bad release. I was at their ball. Yeah, but Steph Curry like literally revolutionized basketball. He's so so like that has to be like in terms of legacy, literally changing the game of basketball has to be seen. Stop late glitching. He's cold because I've late glitched like seven shots. I've never seen anything like this before. That like they're bad releases. The slightlies are bad releases. I'm mistiming on slightlies. Like I'm literally late glitching shots. Constantly. Oh my god. Bad shot. Slightly early. Like they're bad shots. Like I'm not hitting these because they're bad shots. But so many times when I get open, I just end up getting freaking late glitched. I lost this game because every time I got open, I late glitched. For the whole game. Every time I got open, I late glitched. I've never experienced anything like this before in 2K this year. Give me that. Come on, Mick. Be better. Great, I've got two. I've literally got two steals with um, uh, Boozer. I've got two steals with Boozer. None with uh, the guy I wanted to get steals with. Chick, come on. Yeah, I stopped 20 of all time. Not yet. Definitely not yet. It's Antonio McDyess. He can't shoot. Spam. Good defense. Give me that. Big board. Chick. Oh my god, give him the ball. Green that, please. Oh my god. I'm mistiming. I'm mistiming. There's no ifs or buts about it. I'm literally just selling. He just... The CPU's hit a fadeaway white with a guy with no post game. That's the worst part of it. That's like just sold that game. That's not even a win. Sniper's about shooting badge in the game. Um, I don't know. Of course. Of course I get steals with everybody except the one guy I want steals with. How am I getting late glitch on every single shot? Like, this is the weirdest thing ever. I know I'm not releasing these late. You guys saw how much I've been greening with this guy. Is my controller out of battery or something? Please throw the freaking pass to Kyle Lowry. Throw the pass to Kyle Lowry. Oh, I'm 
getting hold. Is that Trey Burke? There we go. It's a slight. He has a missed time release. I just need to start green. Literally, the CPU doesn't get contests. Turn meter on. I'm not turning the meter on. I don't know how to shoot with the meter. Turn the meter. Turn the meter on sometimes works when you know how to shoot with it. It does not work when you don't. Check. Let's go. Mismatch experts best shooting badge by a mile. Oh, we missed. We missed. We missed. We're so out of position. Green. Ah, oh, this game is so horrible. There we go, chick. Let's go. Spam. Spam. Get it, go get it. Let's go. That's one. That's a. Uh, that's just a terrible release. That was definitely an early. I'm trying so hard to not shoot slightly earlies that I actually de genuinely think I shot an early that time. Like, if you were to ask me, did I, that was a complete mistime there. That was most definitely an early one that we shot. Give me that. Chick. Ah, that's not good. Green. Wow! We can't hit whites at all with this guy here. Get up. Okay, we're good. There we go. Appreciate that, Devin. Thank you. Harden is a better scorer than Kobe by like the tiniest bit, but Kobe's also one of the best defensive two guards of all time. I mean, Kobe's significantly better than Harden as a player. Like, like, look, I'm I'm low on Kobe compared to most people, and I've always been low on Kobe. But like, Kobe's so much higher than Harden. Kobe's so much higher than Harden. Give me that big board. Cash the damn ball. Okay, we're good. Chick. Ah, it's terrible. It's fine. Toss the pass to Kyle Larry. I'm not in a position to steal, but I am now. No, I'm not. Give me that. Oh, it's terrible, Mick. Is he physically incapable of hitting a white, though? He hasn't hit a white in two games, I don't think. I have to hit a shot here. You. Shot. Kobe was so much better than Harden. Like. You got lucky there. So what do I need? I need. I want to need three steals. Harden also did lose in the playoffs to a Kawhi Leonard list San Antonio Spurs team, so that is a that's a thing that happened. Griffith. Three more steals. Need eleven more threes. Three more of these and twenty something more points. Spam. 
Harden also averaged one less block. Defensive like stats don't stats don't mean anything for defense. If you think if you think defensive stats matter for defense, then Hassan Whiteside should have been in conversation for defensive player of the year for however many seasons, despite being one of the worst defensive players in the NBA. God. Green. Oh my God! They just shot that. That's guaranteed to go in. If you, if that's an open, that's a, that's an auto make. What? No one defends in the NBA. Yes, they do. They literally are the best defensive players in the world. There is defense. The offensive players are just too good. The sis the not only are the offensive players too good, the systems are too good. Like teams now don't iso ball. Like, if teams iso balled being a good 1v1 defender, you'd see the 1v1 defenders. But now, it's all about team defense because teams are going to run you off 80,000 screens. How are these 12%s? Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Defense overseas is a lot better. No, it's not. It's harder to score because of the way the game is played. It's not. The defense is not better. The EuroLeague defenders are not better than the NBA defenders. They are just not better. The game is played at a slower pace. And the court's smaller, so it's harder to score. The ball is bigger. The defenders are not better. That is a common misconception. The defenders are not better in Europe compared to the NBA. Oh my god. He I'm being clamped right here. She only need 11 threes. Why don't I just run to the basket? Terrible shot. What? That's an open. He you can't play deep. Oh dear lord. Spam. Don't block, steal the ball, man. Way off. Run. Oh my god, can I just hit a shot, man? I just really want to hit a shot. Oh my god, can I hit one? Give me that. Thank you. Oh my god. No way. He greened it. You. You're going to be our shooter now. Oh my god. Why are they clamping me so much? They weren't clamping me in the last game. I started off so well in this run. Like, who thought TT who whoever thought TT offline was gonna be the struggle, not TT online. Whoever thought that I was gonna struggle more in TT offline than TT online. Whoever thought that um, who's bigger, KSI or Aiden Ross? KSI. KSI, obviously. KSI got his album is number one in the charts. KSI. Not even at a base. I still think KSI Heskey Time will never be beaten. That was his greatest ever song. I still think Heskey Time is the greatest ever KSI song. 
I remember I remember listening to Heskey Time. 23rd of December 2011. I remember listening, being in my room listening to Heskey Time. That is how I remember it fondly. 15 year old Mick. Getting ready to go to the to the Irish um the Ireland training camp for the Ireland 16s team. I remember I remember it well. That was a great Christmas period. And I ended up making that Irish team. This is a joke. This is actually a joke. A human cannot hit those shots. Yeah, but Mike Wang has also has also uh, lied plenty of times before. Mike Wang also said early's and lights aren't going to go in. Oh my god, good block. Oh, of course. Of course, he gets lock take. Yeah, if you're spamming, you're getting banned, just a heads up. Don't spam. There's no quote, oh, I'm just spamming, let me chill. No, if you're if you're spamming, then it means you're you're stopping someone with an actual uh, someone else with a question from getting their point across. So yeah, that is a that is a big quite a big deal. You're stopping someone else from posting. Terrible. Oh my god, no. Not losing like this. There we go. No. Not a late fadeaway. There we go. This is what happens when I'm not trying to three hunt. I just need to get these wins. If they score here, I'll be devastated. He has a 43 point rating. I would be devastated if that was what if that was how they got the win on me. There we go. Is Griffin worth it? Uh, I don't know who Griffin is. If you mean Griffith, I don't know. Calvin Murray's one of the worst players in the game. If I complete the wrong boom percent here, I'd be very annoyed. I need five more points, three more steals, eight more threes, and two more games. Okay. The steals are gonna be the worst. Steals are gonna be the worst part. Thoughts on Don James? Um, I think he's really good. My fucking god, man. I forgot how to shoot with him. It's like as soon as I play in rookie, I forgot how to shoot with him. How is humans can't do that? Why can the AI? And li literally, humans cannot green like that. Humans can't just pull up in people's face and green. Do I make money from my streams? Probably not. Probably not. I'm probably not gonna make money from this. I make a little bit from Twitch. I don't make much, but I make a little bit. Like it's not even, it's not even close to a, like if I wasn't even YouTube, it wouldn't even be close to a full-time job on Twitch. It'd be, it wouldn't even be good side money. He should be great under Bielsa. Yeah, but I, I, get to, I think we're getting relegated. I legitimately think we're getting relegated. Oh my god! Like, that's not... That's not fair! This is an all-star difficulty. You're telling me that that's fair. Oh 
Oh my god, I can't even see that. All time D I'm not answering your question. You've answered it you've asked it too many times. I'm not answering it. You've spammed You've spammed taken away from people other people's questions, so I'm not answering your question. Mbappe or Haaland? Haaland. Oh, wow. Some people make a living on fifty to one hundred Twitch viewers. Yes, but they can get those fifty to one hundred Twitch viewers to pay them. I hate I can't because, well, first of all, I don't want to. I hate asking people for money. Like, I legitimately hate it. Like, there is nothing that makes me feel more awkward than trying to sell something to somebody. I'm hopeless at it. I'm terrible at selling. If you want to ask a question, if I'm streaming again, I will answer. But I'm not answering that specific question on this stream. I'm not rewarding someone for spamming by answering their question. Check, let's go. Fem, favorite Prem player, not Leeds. Um, uh, Chashik at Bind, Mr. Jamie Vardy. I've never promoted. People wanted merch, so I just made it. If people want to buy it, it's there. I don't want. I don't like promoting because I don't like selling stuff to people. All right, three pointers are done. So that's a uh, it's rim run. Rim run time. If he missed that, I would have. Sm I would probably smash my controller. You have him four hours. We're if we oh we've got a lock take lock take lock take dribble dribble please dribble please dribble how can I I haven't gotten a single steal on lock take yet I am like three steals away I'm like three steals and two games away if we had gotten more if we didn't get fouled out in the rookie dom game we would have gotten and not lost two games triple shot offline we would have won got it in sub two thirty spam oh my god. Like physically incapable of getting steals. He is the worst. Like you, if you saw me when I was playing triple shot online, he is physically incapable of getting steals. He would like he scored an own basket instead of getting a steal in triple shot online. He is physically incapable of it. He is physically incapable of getting steals. And did you guys just see what happened there? Like. And you guys don't think the AI is... If you guys don't think the AI is unfair, that last possession, like, just sums it up. They, they are so... It's unfair. The AI in this game is unfair. Okay, dribble, dribble, dribble. Dribble the damn ball. There we go. It's one steal. Let's go. Okay. Clyde, come on. Switch. How do you X-switch in this game? I don't know how to X-switch. Two more steals. I literally, I, I have this done. How do you get 40 points in a game? I did it on Rookie Dom. Lewandowski or Ronaldo today? Um, Lewandowski. I need two steals, two more three pointers, and one game. Okay. If I can get two steals in this one game, I win. If I can get two steals in this one game, I got him in around two hours, 30 minutes. Because you can't switch matchups, which is very annoying. Throw the pass. 
Try to pass. Spam, 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 spam. No, they shoot fades every time, man. Who even, is that Harrison Barnes? That does not look like Harrison Barnes. That looks like Slenderman. There we go. Two more. Dalgriff, okay, at three. Yeah, he's fine at the three. I would prefer, I think he's better at the two, but he's fine at the three. How, guys, how do you, how do you guys switch matchups? How do you guys X-switch? I don't know how to do it. Does anyone know how to do it? Just the only way that I can get these steals is by X-switching. Give me one more. I need literally one more three-pointer. And they leak out. Of course the CPU. Of course the CPU cheeses on us. There we go. Bam! Oh my god. Steal! Oh no. It's Harrison Barnes. Harrison Barnes. Harrison Barnes. Oh my god. Steal the damn ball. But he's not He's not um, the primary ball defender. Don't. Actually, I don't need any more points with our Griffith, do I? These are not 24s. The AI is cheesing me as well. They're literally leaking. Ow, oh, that's a steal, 2K. That's not a foul. Oh my god, I'm being cheesed on these last two steals. Oh my god. Steal the damn ball! They're gonna shoot that every time. Like, why can you no longer switch matchups? Like, why can you no longer switch matchups? Like, that's just dumb by me. Okay. Wow. First pull, of the pink diamond. Yes, I do think comes out this week. Yes, I do. First of all, Pink Diamond comes out this week. There we go. Come on. I would be close to 90% sure it comes out this week. Chase down. No. Griffith is the worst. 21. He's a... Sorry, an ADS steal rating is 25. Like, 25 would be generous for Griffith. I've seen 25 steel players get steals better than this Tower Griffith. Can the AI just... Can you just bait the AI, please? Oh my god, you can't bait the AI. You could switch matchups offline. You couldn't do it... Now you can't do it offline or online. You can do it on current gen, though. I probably should have just used, done this on current. Probably should have done this on current. I'm getting cooked here by gold. By literally by gold, um, Harrison Barnes. No way is gold Harrison Barnes cooking me. No, actually, I need to win this game because like I can't, like more more so than even the scores, the steals. I actually need to win this game. I don't care who I score, but I just need to win this game because I need to get him a point guard. Can you get him a point guard? Like, come on. No way! Well, I, I wonder, I reckon Goals Harrison Barnes' rating is probably like 60. Please, Dunk. We could lose. And Harrison Barnes is a sharp take. Oh my god, we could lose. We could actually lose. Oh my god, I'm being hoed. I'm being hoed. I'm being hoed. I'm being absolutely hoed. There's no. If so, what's about? I'm being hoed. 
I actually can't afford to lose this game. I actually can't afford to lose this game. Dunk it. Let's go, come on. Man who came out in the 18th, but yeah, they're not, by the way, they're not doing everything a week later. Flash packs came out like two weeks earlier this year. Just keep dribbling, keep dribbling, keep dribbling, spam. Why would you block? I'm literally spamming square. Why would you block? Terrible shot. I don't even care about the switch because I can probably get the... Yeah, I can get this switch here. Everyone get MOA. Dunk it. Thank you. Let's go. Okay, come on, come on. At least give me Ron Boone. You give me Ron Boone, we're good. Steel tips, I have none. I've been sitting here with two steals to go for the last 40 minutes. I need literally three, two steals. I don't even need to win games. I really don't even need to win games anymore. I literally just need steals. Play, I have to. Oh my god. Spam. Nope. Not good. Again, win or lose, this game doesn't matter. Of course, it's the game I start greening. Hey, literally, Clay's got like 60 ball handle. If I'm loot, if I can't steal the ball off Clay, I'm kind of in a bad spot here. Get back in front. Good defense. Get back into Clay's hand. Start dribbling. Start dribbling. Start dribbling. Clay. Oh my God! Can Clay dribble? Like, why won't Clay dribble the ball? Like, yeah, he's Clay Thompson, but still. Give me the board. Bam. Come on, man. How is Clay? Clay's got half unpluckable. This is literally two steals. Literally two steals. We have spent 40 minutes and we've gotten one steal. In the last 40 minutes of playing this game, we got one steal. One steal in 40 minutes with Dario Griffith. One steal in 40 minutes. Oh my god, Clay freaking Thompson. They at least throw human passes. Not legitimately be impossible to bait. Oh my god. They literally are programmed to not let you... To not let you get steals. I'm telling you. They're doing dumb things to try and not let you get steals. I don't care if I win or lose. I don't want to lose as well. Clay, have you seen some of these drill moves that Clay's pulling off here? Like, look at that. Look at that, man. Look at that. He literally got his body in front and rode... Uh, he just rode Daryl Griffith up the whole court. Like, Have you seen these drill moves from Clay? And of course his Clay can get a steal. Of course his Clay can get a steal. Like, I've been 40 minutes and I've got one steal. One steal in 40 minutes. One in 40 minutes. He just protects the ball. He's not dribbling. He's just protecting the ball. I can't steal the ball. He's just holding L2. He's dribble glitching. The AI literally dribble glitches down the floor. 
Oh my god. Oh my god, how are none of these steals? My hand's going through the ball. Oh my god, dunk it. This AI is a joke. They literally do not. Pass the ball, steal. No, 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 no. Clay Thompson's a freaking force. No way. Clay Thompson used a freaking force to keep that ball in play. I refuse. I refuse. I refuse to believe Clay Thompson did anything other. He's not a Jedi master. No, he's using the force. Forget about forget about this game. Clay is legitimately using the force right now. He is using the force. No way. No way. We can play the best defense ever, but not get a steal because Clay uses the freaking force to keep a ball as way out of bounds inbounds. There is no ifs or buts about it. Clay Thompson is using the force. Thank you. Oh my god, just let me steal one ball. Oh my god. How? We could have got this done in less than 2 hours and 30 minutes. We didn't spend 40 minutes on 3 steals. We've gotten 2 steals in, 40, in 44 minutes. I thought we were going to get... We could have got this sub 220. Like, this is doable in, so, in less than 2 hours 20 minutes. This is do easily doable in less than 2 hours and 20 minutes. Just make him pick up his dribble. Throw the damn pass. You're stuck, you're stuck, you're stuck. You're stuck, you have to. Oh God, just throw the freaking pass to Clay. We're there. Dribble, 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 spam. No! He's doing everything he can. He will intentionally miss a shot if it means I can't strip him. Steals on current easier. Yes. I will probably go to current if I lose. If I don't get it here. I literally need one. I literally need one. What about getting steals on rookie? I fouled out because um, I got like five steals. And then once he got lock take... Like, look how far I am off getting take because of the steal situation. It's an early, it's a terrible shot. Oh my god, can you please just throw a bait? Can you please just throw the ball into my hands, man? Can you please just throw. Oh my god, they're shooting that. Like, I'm, I'm bricking these. My god, can you just steal the ball? I fell out because once I got lock take, I, I forgot how to steal the ball. I was stripping John Wall all the time, and as soon as I got lock take, I couldn't steal Eric, Bob Merrick Gordon. No, he went through me. Let's watch, let's watch, let's watch, let's watch. Let's watch. Let's watch. <laughs> let's keep an eye out on this. Let's keep an eye out on this, lads. I need one steal. I need one steal. Let's watch. Let's watch. First of all, I swipe through the ball. Then he dribbles and I swipe through the ball again. Like, what? What? This AI is a joke. This AI is a joke. I deserve one here. I deserve this. I deserve that. I deserve that, 2K. Put the ball on the floor, Jackson Hayes. He's, he's dotting corner. They're shooting ridiculous stuff. They legitimately shoot ridiculous stuff. Oh, 
Do not shoot. What? Like what? Just what? Steal. Let's go! Let's go. Let's uh, stop the freaking timer. Stop the freaking timer. Oh my god. Literally, we would have gotten sub 230. We spent 40 minutes on three steals. We would have had that sub 230 if we didn't need steals. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's about time, man. If we get Ron Boone here, this would be great. If this is not a subathon, no, I'm finished. Here's a speed run. Here's a speed run. It's a freaking speed run, lads. We did it. We actually did it, lads. We it's about damn time we did it. Two hours forty-seven minutes. Two hours forty-seven minutes. We broke the non-Ron Boone percentage. Or the, yeah, we broke the no, world record for the no, no Ron Boom percent. We did it, lads. We did it. Two hours, 47 minutes. From start to finish. We got Dial Griffith. Oh, lads. Lads, lads, lads. We did it. Lads. So, lads, what we're going to be doing right now, unfortunately, the, the you suck chance aren't gonna, can't be a thing, but, lads, we are going to raid Brian for three. We are going to be raiding Brian for three, lads. I'm going to be online for about another 10 seconds, 10, 15 seconds. You can go to sleep, Colin. You actually waited up for that, man? Why? Did you not? You started college now, haven't you? Yeah, you start college today. Jesus. We're gonna be riding Brian. So uh yeah, go um go follow Brian. Go check out Brian on Twitch. See you lads. <laughs>